wood-based textile fibers will play a crucial role in replacing cotton during the following decades. The demand for textiles is rapidly increasing, while the arable land for cotton cultivation is shrinking. There are many cellulose-based materials tried to fulfill the requirements of, of different uh, textile applications, but by now, cotton and, and uh, viscose regenerated cellulose are the best. The easiest way to use cellulose uh, resources is uh, using forest and wood. There are several different technologies to produce textile fiber from wood. The oldest, the viscous method, has been around for over a century. Due to the environmental burden of the usage of sulfur in the process, new innovative ways to dissolve cellulose are being developed all over the world. One way is to use so-called ionic liquids. It is a similar process to lyocell, but the solvent is different. It is a ionic liquid, which is very powerful solvent. And the properties of the pilotted or lab scale fiber are very promising. Challenges are similar to lyocell in that case, because the solvent must be circulated and, and <coughs> regenerated from the spinning path to the dissolution stage again, and wastewater must be clean. Another way to dissolve pulp is using urea, which enables the use of waste textiles as raw material. A third example of new technologies is fiber spinning without solvents. It is a nice idea of using pulp itself, not dissol dissoluted pulp or even dissolving pulp. Pulp fibers, uh, to combine them a similar, similar way than in, in strong paper, paper in fiber form, very close to each other, using a special, a special spinneret, and they are not using any, any chemicals. Forest Biofacts, everything you need to know about forest-based products and technologies.